lab level one at the at this lab we're gonna make a the start a new schematic this is just a zener diode with the uh, resistance connected in series and a 10 volt dc supply r is in the analog and the dc uh, supply we go you can go and in the source library the diode is zener this you can find easily in the just type d1 n750 is not found in design cache so what you gonna do in the design cache you find it just select all the libraries and search the part you will get it the source you will find in the v source or source vdc because it's a downward dc supply idc no vac vdc vdc select it it is 10 volt value only run the simulation we're gonna give a dc sweep because we have a dc component keep a voltage marker at the uh, diode So V1 is the voltage source and give a DC sweep. This is the 10 volt DC. Starting value is 1 and then increment 1. So from 1 to 10. How do our circuit respond? We will see it. So this is the we see that after 4 volt it start conducting now we want to examine the results so we gonna add a trace this is id1 current flowing through the d1 we see that uh, after 4 volt is stuck on the 4 volt is the point where conduction start so up to 4 volt the circuit is open now double click edit the piece voice model so what we're gonna do is we're gonna change the BV value right now So this will show the model editor file for the D1 and 50. There is a BV parameter of 4.7 in which is which gonna change. This is all the parameters like uh, IS current RS. change the BV value to 8 volt eight point zero. so now the new value is the 8 where the diode will start conducting then a diode will start conducting now at an 8 volt
so see it's uh, conducting after the 8 volt so as we can change the BV the BV was before 4 now it's 8 so it start conducting at the 8 volt add another dress press like ID 1 the, this is like after 8 volt it start conducting so it, it's in between 8 to 10 volt the conduction starts